welcome back to this thing. Nice little way through the game. Now, I was about to start, and I realized I'd totally forgotten about him. I also restocked on the bombs. Also, the birds fuck off when there's something to do here, which is nice. Fuck you, guys. Yeah, I honestly can't believe I almost forgot to get this, um, secret skill. Hidden skill, whatever the fuck they're called. Yes, we meet again. Hmm? Yeah, I don't remember what this is. Mortal draw is easy. Why even take the sword out? I know it's a pre-canned animation, but... Well, a canned animation. Whatever the fuck you want to call it. Just what always happens. Oh, jump strike. Oh. Yeah, of course. Of course, I fucking forgot. Groovy. Bam. Just like that. Okay. The training room intensifies. No, not quite. This music is actually good. Hold day. Wait for the little flash. If this was a platinum game, or rather, if this was made today, the blade would have like this big red, like, flashing spark appear on it. I love that little effect they use in platinum games. I'm pretty sure Breath of the Wild's got its own. It's been so long since I've actually played it, so... Yeah. <laughs> Whoever's watching this probably has played more Breath of the Wild than I have. Or played it more recently than I have, I should say, rather. Okay, is that there? Nice. So I restocked on bombs. I don't... I'd maybe mention that. I don't fucking remember. My brain's going, apparently. Um... There's not a lot I can spend rupees on from memory. I think I've just about done it. I can waste some cash at the, uh, at the lure game, but, well, that's not really something. That's like 10 ago from memory. All I can really do, and I just thought of it, um, as I was starting, is I can walk here and I can do this. I can give you a ton. How much is it? I'll give you 30, I don't care. Have a tip, bird. You know what? I, can I just thank you? You know what? Because I want to get rid of some. Yep. See you, nerd. Bird. Hey, buddy, did you get a load of that bird? Excuse me? Wow, that was a... I don't know if that's the quickest time to Simpsons reference, but it must be pretty fast. Alright, so instead of wolf form, we traverse this in human form. Oh, wow, what? Now look, I, I forgot it was Russell, you know, like, one of the, you know, I can't believe it. It's just such a revelation. I was blatant sarcasm, I'm stating it in case it somehow wasn't blatant enough. Yep, temple deep in the woods, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, this is the first I've heard of it. Nope, don't know anything about any temple. Um. Yes, I would like to, please. I will have a drink of my soup while his noble partner appears. <coughs> Expectation subverted. You thought it would be the hawk. It's much more majestic. Look at that cuckoo. Cuckoo. Ready, my child? Ah, yes, the most noble of beasts. And you probably couldn't see that as well on the GameCube or Wii version. This cuckoo. Noble. Oh, yes, of course. He's actually quite chill. Prick.
you want me, but you can't have me. Kimpachi Rama some of the chicken. How can you be so flippant yet so desirable, Golden Cuckoo? Alright, so yep, this is why we can't do it in all form. The ropes are mysteriously gone. Russell flew over to cut them before we got here. I'm pretty sure we lose it. So we need a cuckoo just for that. Hey little birds, what's up dudes? Can I talk to you? Nope. Hey, you uh, ready for a rematch? Cause I'm ready. Shit dude, it's only been like three episodes. Alright, you know the drill. If once the cutscene ends. Fuck. I mean, you, you probably won't do it in human form, but I don't care. Also, that's a nice little detail because it's um, darker. You can go away. He didn't go this way. Where'd he go? It's been quite hard for me to hear him. I feel like I should have seen him just here, but... Maybe I should have done more research and not at all. Can you guys fuck off? Thank you. Oh yeah, there he is. Duh. Of course he'd hide this time. He's learned from his mistakes. Okay, now I've learned from my mistakes. Whoa, that was, and we go this, no, not doing the same thing as last time. I will get you after this. Mark my words. Where's that? Yep. Actually, fuck it, we're gonna get it now. You guys, leave me alone. Stop bullying me. Stop cyberbullying me. Now look at hyper armor. More hyper armor than two-handed letters great hammer. Nah, it's a light enough. It has more armor than that. I, yeah, I don't even remember how hit stun works in Breath of the Wild. It's been that long. That's something I'm. I don't know why I'm suddenly so interested in thinking of it, but yeah. Oh yeah, can you guess what we do here? Excuse me a second. Guys. A lot easier, isn't it? Do, 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 do. Where is the lantern? There we go. This better be a piece of heart. Oh, we're so close to standing on it. Oh, I want to say I'll get one, but that's a blatant lie. There's no way. No at this point. Right as I restocked, thanks. Hmm, great. Yeah, fuck you, buddy. So I'm going to test this out. I want to test this out. Come on. That can be defeat such a defense. Look how little damage it does though. Insulting really. I wish the ball and chain was better than it is. I really, really do. I mean, at least the spinner got something Hyrule Warriors. I don't even remember if the, um, if the ball and chain ever did. I feel like it might have, but I, yeah. 
Don't know, don't know the game well enough. Yeah, there we go. Because he's up on a ledge, right? Hey, look, more lands, more uh, sconces, braziers. You know what? I'm not even trying to style on him, but I accidentally am. I actually want to do the uh, whole um, jump attack we just learned. Okay, they do nothing great. Oh, we are meant to go this way. I was thinking he'd be like on a little outcropping or something. Well, we are going in circles, aren't we? If only there was a scent of Skull Kid. We've been had. Play like a goddamn trumpet. Oh no, he's in this room. Yeah, no, he is up there, I guess. Probably super wrong. Ah, miss me, idiots. Very good. Very good. You know what's even better? In fact, I'm wrong. Illusory wall? No. Borderline, but not quite. Alright, let's try this out. Gotta make some distance so I can actually charge. Okay, guess we are not getting to distance. Where'd your last friend go? What a stellar way to start off the episode. Fighting these mooks. Alright. Now uh, I went, went the wrong way, clearly. Hmm. Can you guys... Come on. I was hoping you'd be the smart one and know to walk away. Alas. Alright. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. The light um, in the other direction threw me off, but I knew I was forgetting something. Hey, shitlord. That is actually good, though. Like, it made me look very stupid, but I like that. I like that. I don't know why the intonation on that was so weird in the first place. <laughs> and then I uh, drew more attention to it, to it the second time, but meh. Yeah. Yeah. Where you at? Where you at, Skull Kid? Ooh. Let's be a real dick. Hmm. I don't know. It feels like, it feels like we should go the other way. I was really stilted. I don't know why. I just want to see if we could warp for the hell of it. Alright, where you at? Where you at, Skull Kid? The rematch. Truly the jet stream, Sam, we deserve. Who's the gas coin of this game? Who, who's the boss that's a wall? Um, I'll give you a hint, no one. I mean, maybe Agarok. Someone we have not met yet. But we'll see relatively soon. Here we go. Almost like it was designed to be them. Hit shit. With your shitty little Poe Lantern. Yeah, that always struck me as weird. They get stuck up on the uh, geometry. Oh god damn it! It's in the wrong place. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, beautiful splash damage. Or is it area of effect? No, it's splash. <laughs> like any good explosive should have. Sirs. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Nailed one in front of me and then just fucking obliterated him. You define that as fun. Yes. And you define it as, <laughs> define it as fun despite the fact it's obviously very painful. Um. 
Well, excuse me. Yes, that was a um, very shit steamed hams reference. I, I don't want recognition because it's a Simpsons reference. It's just I'm apologizing because it was bad. Oh, that's right. Wait, no. Is there a second puzzle? I don't think so. I know we're about to get a warp point in this place we definitely have not returned to. Ooh, look at this. Skulls with... You know, I know it's video game logic, but it's kind of weird when you think about it. A skull has a... has cash in it. Wish this guy move, though. That's what you just got down from. Oh. I feel like I've missed something. Oh wait, no, is it on, it's on the way back? Or am I doing this like five seconds too early? Nope, I'm doing this correctly. Do it, Link. Hey, look at that. We can use that door now. Cool. I'm sure nothing will impede our um, nice little jog back. I'm sure nothing will happen like a combat encounter involving messengers and a bunch of keys. Oh. Oh. I could double down with the, with the Plinket references and just say, what's wrong with your face? I mean, I just did, but... You know, I can't be bothered, so let's just... Let's do this how it's meant to be done. Yeah, fuck you. Yep. Come on, nerds. Huddle on in. And, yep. Yep, we were betrayed. Betrayed by Seek the Scaleless. Sorry, Seif for Pale Drake, because that makes him sound cool, and now it doesn't. Makes him sound just as lame. I mean, it's an upgrade from his former title, Seif for Bitch, so... I held off on the Dark Souls references a little longer than usual. Give me some credit, alright? There we go. I mean, that's got to be some kind of record. Not overtly going, hey, Dark Souls. I was just thinking, someone should just just respond with the cliche response of, well, if you love Dark Souls so much, why don't you marry it? Or what if I could? Miyazaki won't let me. I'm not good enough for his daughter. Is it Tanama or River Maid too? I, don't, I forget the guy's name. He seems cool, though. I mean, he fucking saved that game, so there's that. Ah. Huh. You recognize that music, kids? Recognize this camera problems? Um, these camera problems? I guess it's proper ink. Fucking, I don't care. Huh. Can't do anything with that. <gasps> What's this? If only. Squish the bug. <laughs> He's like, here, Agatha, I got it for you. Oh, look at it. Females now. It might be a dude, though. We don't judge. We're inclusive here. We're very accepting of everyone, alright? I don't think I need the bomb arrows immediately. Oh, I could have bought more arrows, but I mean, doesn't matter, because look. I just don't like the rupees going to waste. Okay, well great, because I'm getting arrows now, I now have incentive to actually break the fucking boss. So, um... Yeah. Sorry, the game's incentivizing. Hmm, this room looks vaguely familiar. It's not as nice as the Wind Waker one, with all its little uh, murals. That was a nice room. And then you have the double Dark Knight fight. It is just two, right? It's not three. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just two. It's the really cool looking ones. Spoilers for a game older than this.
Run! Run, chicken! Arise, chicken, arise! Hmm, it's like that staircase from Subspace Emissary, but not really. Yeah, I don't know if Smash Bros. Um, if, if it ever has a story, I don't think it can top Subspace. I mean, it, World of Light is, but me saying that kind of proves the point. <laughs> that, uh, well, it can't, it, it, you know, World of Light didn't definitely fucking top it. I'm not treating it like a story mode. I barely played that mode, and I was really excited for it. I wonder what we do there. Huh, weird. Anyway. We need to arise, chicken. Arise. Ooh. I'll get my stuff. It, isn't it like there should be another one? I mean, that's just your obsessive-compulsive nature at kicking in. Everything doesn't have to be symmetrical. I mean, in this case, I would agree. Give me the damn symmetry game. <laughs> Sometimes, like, you know, being a, you know, things asymmetrical, it's the, th th things that are asymmetrical. Things that don't look identical either side can uh, look very nice sometimes. If it's an artistic um, choice. Asymmetrical. See, I, I can do it. I can do it. Everyone doubted me. Nobody, nobody thought, nobody believed, but now you see. No one remembers Phytopedia. I mean, I do, by virtue of saying it, um, but outside of me, no, you forgot instantly as soon as I mentioned the name of that series. Not so fast. You're not getting past me. This is using that one system from Shadow of Mordor. You're that guy that hurt me at the start of the game and now I've reappeared several times and I'm going to fight you in an arbitrary fake rival battle. While cool system, like, uh, I've never played Shadow of Mordor so I might be sound sounding a little harsh, but it sounds good on paper, but... I don't think a like, I guess almost procedurally generated rival battle, just like something like that is going to feel as good as say, I don't know, um, Virgil. Just putting it out there, I mean that's a high bar to top, but that's kind of what they're going for by default. And it sucks, but it's the truth. What? Oh, wow. That's right, you take four. You've got a lot of health. Uh, yeah, so... We can do some stuff. Such as this. We. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. I've realized my mistake. Learning experience, kids. Yay! I hope that awkward silence, um, you know, paid off. Alright, claw shot there, bow there. Can, can I just use the claw shot? I mean, it wants me to use the bow, but claw shot is totally acceptable. Ah, yes, you. My oldest rival. You burned my face in the grand eating hall that one day. So I'm come back to fight you for an arbitrary mini boss fight. Frack the cook. Or whatever the fuck. Sir, oh, wait your turn. Sir, wait your turn. Because they all get some. Suckers to the side. 
Um, what is it? Fucking... I'm trying to quote Public Enemy, I don't remember it. I know you hate my 98. You gonna get yours? But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's about right. This guy's cool, though. Yeah, that's right. The, uh, spinning round doesn't work as well as you'd hope sometimes. Nice. Well played, Nomad Soul. Well played. Man, I hope if I ever subject myself to Omicron, whether or not it's on camera, it breaks as hard as it did for them. I really hope. I just rewatched the end the other day, and it's just like... I guess that was their magnum opus. Nothing could top the LP. I'll get the chest, don't worry. It's probably a map. I'm pretty sure it is, anyway. Like, yeah, Omicron was the peak of the Zaibatsu, I think. Yeah, I meant to do that. Shut up. Alright, is it a dungeon map? Yeah, it was an opportunity for me to have a sip. I need to go for my water now, damn it. Yeah. Let's try to... Oh no, um, run, run out of time. Shit, um... They're very professional with me, I know. I do this as a job for the meantime, so I, I can be excused of unprofessionalism. Totally. It's fine to be unprofessional. Hmm. Curious, is it not? You want some? Oh, really? You know what? I'll give you a chance, alright? Show, show me what you got with your scimitar. Yep. Okay, yeah, yeah. You get out of here. Scimitar's not... Well, actually, no. Scimitar is pretty meta. Worth. Totally worth it. You can't tell me so. Yeah, and this ghost just won't come out... Um... No matter how much you insult it or yell at it, this ghost will not leave. If you ask where the fuck where the fuck it's at, it will not. If I recall, yeah, I don't don't remember exactly where the theory is in this dungeon, but it's closer than you'd think. No, it's probably not. To be quite honest. Um, those are the spiders though, they may or may not be gomers, guess what they are gomers. Um, totally end up in some pots later on. So that's actually pretty cool. Hey look, we get to use it! And, oh yeah, I meant to go back to the place to use this. There's a spot in Hyrule Field I have not used the spinner for, and there is a spot I need to use the spinner for in the Sacred Grove proper. So we'll do that. We can't go through there yet. Cool. This one always annoyed me. Yeah, because if you try pushing it the wrong way, it just it's really stubborn. Aggressively stubborn. We'll grab you for some reason. Uh, uh, the hell I know. This really is the high life. Oh, come on, come on, no, no, it's meant to be cool. <clears throat> Make your Beyblade references now. Because that's original. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm using a Wing Knight Halberd. Isn't it funny how I spin like a top? Yes, it's amusing. Or you can use the weapon like a real fucking. Well, it's not a real Halberd. <laughs> You know, Glaive Master Hodir. See, that wasn't a Dark Souls reference. That was a Elden Ring reference. Maybe the Elden Ring is the root. Is 
Maybe the real Elden Ring is the bullshit the fans made up along the way. Maybe Elden Ring's just fake. Maybe it's never going to happen because uh, someone didn't finish the script. Aha! I never watched the show or read the book, so I'm immune. I don't care for... Okay, you know what? This is getting... No, this is old. I don't care. Alright, let's just... Yep, let's just massacre him properly. Wow, it's almost like it's incentivizing the use of the bow. Yep. I don't think there was any... Yep. Yeah. Okay, nope. There was a point. Good. I was getting worried there for a sec. If I recall, fun stuff is going to happen when we uh, smash that BMO somehow. Hmm. We might need something with a big hammer. Yeah. Don't know where we'd find that. I'm going a long way, aren't I? Wait, where am I even meant to take this? Why am I... Wait. Where am I even meant to go with this? Yeah, no, that's not it. I'm feeling very clever right now. I need to get a key from somewhere. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me, um... I'll take it with me just in case. I feel like I'm meant to go up, because the Poe is for later. I can't do that now. There's nothing on this level I can actually do for the meantime. Am I pressing it the right way? I am not. Pushing it the wrong way, I should say, rather. Can we go up one more level? Is that... Yep. Yep. Okay. Yeah. That's what I was forgetting. Just for convenience. There we go. I was thinking, like, yeah, there's got to be one more level, but... Oh, fuck you. Great. Um... Holy shit. Why do I... If you can't tell, we're getting we're getting to the point of the game where my mem memory isn't as great. I still remember most of it. Oh Jesus! Can we beat it? The answer lies in the heart of battle. Wow! Holy shit! This was I don't know if I'd say embarrassing, but it was uh, not great. Come on! Those are real Beyblades there. They'll fuck you up. That's the weirdest part of working at school, so, like, seeing the fact that Beyblades came back, or at least in this state of this country, like, I, I can't believe it. At the same time, when I learned the history of Beyblades, you know, it's a rich history, it's a rich tapestry, but, um, no, seriously, when I learned about, like, it's just a recurring thing for the most part. Like, I'm like, oh. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, yeah. Oh, fuck, these guys hurt. I'm like, oh, yeah. Oh, that explains a lot, actually. Mortal draw these fucks. But, um, yeah. That's just weird. And when I told the kids, oh, yeah, we had Beyblades. Literally a decade and a half ago, not that long ago. <laughs> um... Or a bit over, but like, oh, what? It's like, yeah. And I'm the same, but you guys have them now. <laughs> hmm. Except ours look a lot, looked a lot dumber. I, I had that red one with the weird, like, spring stand thing. I don't know. It was the one with the fucking phoenix looking guy on it. Um. Wasn't a very good Beyblade. <laughs> I think there's a reason all the ones, or at least all the ones the kids have, are just the generic one. Not something over, like, exaggerated or extravagant, it's just, it's functional. And, and, yep, as, as consequence, it actually fucking works. Now, just as a reminder, I've got four full heals on me. So, I'm not healing till I take, like, critical damage. I wonder what's going to happen here. Am I going to get more arrows all of a sudden? I don't know. Really? Huh. Oh, crazy. That's weird. I didn't, didn't actually get any. It knows. It's the adaptive ammo system from... Um, oh, there we go. It's it's the ammo system from RE4. It knows I haven't used the TMP, so it's going to keep giving, it, giving me some to troll me. 
as I said, I've never made it far enough through that. I'm just referencing a ginger. A small gremlin ginger. A ginger gremlin. And his battle against the TMPs. And the snakes. That he swore he will never get bitten by. Just like Rich Homie Kwan swore he would never stop going in. No, you don't. I missed, but I've got a, I've got a bit of startup. Link's startup animation to superior to the Beemos. Is that why Beemos called Bemo? I don't fucking know. I, I don't. I, I know there's some story explanation in actual Adventure Time, but I don't know. Is it a reference? Maybe. Wow. Would you believe I like running bow builds and Dark Souls? But I can't shoot for shit in this game for some reason. Oh. You didn't let me do the cool thing. Yeah, what's the point when I should just do that? No. You don't get the flourish of that, Link. We fucked up. Now we get to do it for that. He had a cool, like, Predator Skull, so... A Mad Warrior set. Hmm. Wonder what we do here. Hitbox. Good enough. And they know some... Um... So, some Australian dude who's not very good at aiming will play this game, and they made the hitbox bad on purpose. Ah, yes, banana faults. Let's go. What you got? What you got? Come on, come on. We got a real match now. You're not meant to dodge like that. Though. And they have the fake finish, which is actually pretty cool. Hell's it. End of a ropes. He's done it. By God. Well, I want to get better with with Incineroar, so uh, better start learning those mechanics. Huh? Look at that. There's um, hmm. There's a pressure plate on the other side of this electric fence. If only we had some way to move one of those objects. Yeah, I know it's not it's not cute anymore. My dumb, whatever you call it, being coy about mechanics will gain within the next like ten minutes. It's not been cute like 15 episodes ago. Wait, no, this hasn't been going for 15. I just proved, by the way, yeah. Oh, no, I didn't. I was gonna prove about the shitty, uh, shitty finishing attack. But, um, I didn't get to actually do it. Yo, yeah, Bomber has worked really well in these guys. From memory, the second I said that, I'm like, wait, no, do they? <laughs> I'm getting a little worried. It would also be great if we could smash these walls. I'm doing it again, fuck's sake. Yeah, just, if I, if I say anything like that, take it as, oh, he's, he's going to be able to in like 10 minutes. We just got to have a really sick fight first. Yeah, okay, I remember this room. We're in the scales. Scales of Justice. I like the AI on, AI on these guys. When you're facing them, um, they, they coward out. But the second you turn your back... <laughs> and they said fish AI is impressive. Ow, son of a bitch. Don't turn your back on the wolf pack. Is that that one? Something about body bags. I bet they just give you the arrows though, for massacring them. Where you at? Where you at? Oi. Yay, a chest for our troubles. My god. Who's seen that coming? What we got? Oh, yay. Hey, look at that. Back to a thousand. I'm ecstatic. <clears throat> Maybe I should do the uh, Wolf Amiibo uh, dungeons. <gasps> Nani? Masaka. No? Really? Link's too fat? <laughs> yeah, I can't get those for now, which kind of sucks. 
I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is how we do it, but it's a bit of a dodgy throw. Oh, yep, nailed it. Link's heavier than one of those. I mean, I guess when you think of all the equipment, the mail he's got on under a tunic. Yeah, it's a Poe, by the way. If I can, yeah, there we go. Get him on camera. All the weapons, all the equipment, the bottles. Yeah, I guess he's heavy. Oh, damn it, come on. Gotcha. Whoop. Whoop. We got a real match now. Alright. Up the stairs? Seems it. Let's play Frogger. I done it. Come on. No, you don't. I got the Leer I got the Leer ring on. Counter damage for all. Fucking Come on. Come on. You can do it, boys. You're strong, capable, Liz Alphos. Liz Alphos. If you drop me a list of stuff, that'd be very cool. I've never received it. It's not really that good. I'm using the Witch Tree branch instead, but... It'd be nice just to have it for once. Ah, oh, look, see if they learn. Adaptive AI. See, often of course doesn't learn your moves, but these guys do. Hey, look at that. How cute. How charming, how quaint. That was actually closer than I thought. You know what I should just do? You know what? Hold on. Can't stop me now, fuckers. Nothing can stop me now, but for now I don't care anymore. Thank you, Trent Reznor. Fuck you, Trent Reznor. I haven't really got anything to add. I don't really want to continue with the Cold Steel train of thought. Let's redeem myself. God, even with gyro aiming. You know what? Hold on, hold on. Let's use the six to recenter. Fuck. I'm just doing this now because uh, I don't know if you can tell those guys are going to wake up. Gotcha. <gasps> Wow. A little something for me? Wow. You shouldn't have. I don't know what I was meant to be, but... Funny it was not. Well... Hold up. Are you guys awake? See you later, fuckers. Look at this tech. It's so broken. You can't stop it. Gonna use that Twilight Princess Evo. Right after the Sekiro PvP tournament hosted by St. Ryan. The fact that Sekiro PvP is a thing now is actually hilarious. <laughs> and cool! Cool as hell. Wait, do I need... No, I do not. I can break these pots with impunity. In fact, I will be encouraged to because the next room will... Ah, uh... oh, well, I'm going to be fighting something, so... Maybe I can put the magic armor on to relieve all the tension in the scene. Yeah, no, I make the joke, but it actually does. It legitimately does remove all the tension. I mean, I just could not use it, but... Have you seen my wallet? I, I've got it. Okay, hold on. I still have how many bugs to... Okay, fucking joysticks. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I still have one, two, three, four bugs to hand in, and then I'm missing another five. Let's see. Butterfly, snail, two day flies. Yeah. Um, no, yeah, I handed everything else in. And yeah, I'm still missing the ant and two mysterious bugs. I would say, you know, I was going to say dragonfly, but I've got them. You know what? 
while we're waiting, and by waiting I mean I'm being dumb. Yeah, I'd like to keep going. Oh no, the time, except it's wrong, because I didn't fix the, the fucking clock. Because who cares at this point? So not, not like this thing has internet anymore. Shop's gone, so fuck it. Soup, give me sustenance. What a shame. He's, he was a good boss. What a rotten way to die. Are you ready? Appearing later than the Dark Nuts and Wind Waker, but just as fucking awesome. Is this, is this the best one in the game? Potentially. The ones in the Cave of Ordeals are pretty sick too. So, you know, oh, whoops. They're not the one I'm trying to. He's got a moose head. So I should just be a little more patient. There we go. Come on. Oh, damn it. That's that trailer shot they used in all the footage. In the old movie that used to precede the game. It is cool, like how they've got the two forms though. It's pretty akin to Wind Waker though. Where you reveal their fleshy dog exterior. You know, interior. Are you ready? Because I'm going to make a JoJo reference. Are you ready for it? Hey guys, Silver Chariot. This guy I'm less certain on how to fight. I think a lot of well-timed... Back. Yep, oh, we broke his guard so... I also really like this music too. I, I know it's the one we had in the mines. Gore on mines, but yeah. Truly, not as majestic as the Deku Toad, though. One more combo should do it, I think. I'm feeling it, but potentially more. I'm really feeling it. Would it be cool if a Dark Knight got in as a Zelda character for Smash Bros? It'd be cool, but there's more characters I'd like. Girahim, Bruce, I know there's a bunch of guys like Varty that people love. Just put in Beast Ganon, just a troll. <laughs> or just... I, I saw people say Old Ganon. Like Old Pigman Ganon. Get good. Even though you got some good hits in there. I mean, he didn't do as much as I was worried about, but still. Some solid hits nonetheless. Alright. Sure to put on the armor for last. Nah. Okay, you ready to get a really cool thing that's severely underutilized. But at the same time, it's like the spinner, where I can understand why it's underutilized, because holy shit, it's super limited. But nonetheless, that shadow... Oh, it's doing that fucking thing in TF2. It used to happen all the time in Team Fortress, where the shadow would um, go through um, the environment. In Left 4 Dead as well, it's really handy for identifying where a tank was. Because sometimes you could see him. Or you could see his arm clipping through a wall. That's, you know, that's arguably easier, in fact. Sorry, I'm just moving my chair. Getting in nice and close. Oh, fucking headphones. Cheap $10 Sony headphones. Why you do this? Alright. Hey, it's like that part in Wind Waker. It is explicitly like that part in Wind Waker. So that's annoying. And it should have been closer. To God. There's another Nine Inch Nails reference for you. 
I don't think we want to feel that statue on the inside though. Or, f sorry, from the inside. Is that it? Yeah. I think so. I haven't listened to Closer for quite some time. Time. Singular, not plural. Anyway. Um, enough of that. Enough of the references for like five seconds. Time to smash some shit. Okay, I lied. Break stuff. Give me something to break. How about your fucking face? You don't have hacker chainsaw, I'll, I'll skin your ass roll. Fred Durst, a true poet. Huh, but that's weird. If only there was some way we could get him on in time. Hmm. Odd. Ow. <laughs> I meant to do that. I was going to show it eventually, so... Now would be an excellent time. You know, I've just come up with an excellent idea for, like, the end of this dungeon. I'm not, not going to divulge what it is just yet. Well, right when we're about to, uh, end our little partnership, but it's only temporary. As Knuckles explains, in the epic ballad, are known from me. Knock knock, it's knuckles. Yep, I'm aware. Time to give you the colder shoulder. Because his spike goes through boulders. I unironically love that song. <laughs> like a lot of songs in that game. Foes games, both adventure games. I've got a soft spot for it. I mean, technically, yes, it's nostalgia, but... Yeah, just, just... I'm just gonna let this sit for a second, alright? Alright, you ready to be free? Hey. Guess what? Get hammered, motherfucker. I'm, I'm gonna drink the soup in case I accidentally clobber myself. Um, give me a sec. Thanks, Yeto. Oh, it's not full heal. Oh, well, good enough. It's fine. I think I need to spin it for one more section. Could be wrong. Wait, what am I doing? I need you. I don't think I even need the demi- uh, the, uh... I don't know if I even need the, uh, bloody, um, claw shot. I do for one part, right, right at the very start, but that's it. I think I need the spinner for one part. Yep. Yep, it's happening. There was always a specific way I wanted to order items in Wind Waker as well. From memory, it was, um... Oh, nice. It was the bow and the boomerang on the face buttons and hookshot on the Z. I'm talking GameCube, obviously. I'd no doubt be making the same mistakes for the, uh... For Wind Waker HD. Yeah, I need the spinner for that. Hmm. So you see, the trick is, or well, that it's not really a trick, but getting up there might be advantageous somehow. Perhaps if we could get high enough, we might be able to latch onto this. Oh, how tragic. Link cannot make it. Hmm. The fat controller will not be pleased. I don't want to hear anyone's best dark Thomas the Tank Engine theories. I'm good. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't need to know anything about that. Hmm. I've just realised I've made a horrible, horrible mistake. I was trying to preempt, but as a consequence, I preempted too much. Hmm. This is a. Uh, this is good. Good. I know the exact solution here, but I'm uh, doing it in the most shitty way possible. Because I'm clever like that. Nice. Come, my children. Yeah, that's 
not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. There we go. And there we go. Yep, that's how you do <laughs> That's how you do it. Ah, oh, fuck. Fantastic. Outstanding. Oh. It begins. Wow, I'm impressed that, uh, that worked. I'm impressed that worked, eh? Very good. I totally missed, fuck. Jar it! Don't fail me now. You have failed me. Myself. Come on, there we go. Yep. So throwing that one down wasn't inherently bad, but it's annoying because I gotta walk all the way back. So I believe you need all of them to uh, counterbalance. But scales of justice. Really? Where? On which side? Do the phantom thieves stack up? Stack, stack up. Fuck. Are they good guys? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. But I don't know. The rumors and public opinion. Yes, no, they're good guys. Fuck off. But they stand out in Japanese society. You shouldn't stand out. So that's inherently bad. Supposedly. I mean, I'm only saying this from an outsider perspective, so... Yeah. And I'm only parroting what I've heard. And cliches of that, too. Why am I missing? Come on, what you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? I know that's a trope in all the Japanese stuff, though. About the rumors. And about... Standing out from the crowd and such. I feel like there's a real life message in it, but I'm not fucking saying it. Screw you. You work it out. Alright, my child, are you ready? Onwards. There is not enough room. The Poe is being a dick. Alright, guess what we gotta do now? It's really fun. This is the most enjoyable part of this whole fucking dungeon. You ready? Hope I don't miss. Two. Three. Good combo. Four. Such good aim. I mean, what's up with that? There we go. Also got that dumb joke in. Yay, we done it. That's what Dunny Don don't did. I fuck, I screwed that up. Don't do what Dunny don't don't do. Is that it? Simpsons reference. DLP. Well, Simpsons reference. The ch no, you know what? No, that is still best best friends. On well, Matt's channel, technically now. Come on, there we go. Thank you, Gyro. For making me do more work than I really need to. So yeah, that one's kind of redundant. We don't need it. I feel like I do for something. Is there a hidden thing? I don't know. Well, spin a time. Are you ready? If I can find it. Hey, you know what? What? That's not what I wanted. Polatin, is, uh, is are you sure there's one in the vicinity? Alright, I'll trust you. So yeah, that's what it looks like. I'm not saying that like a fact I didn't know that's what it looked like. I haven't fucking used this fish. <laughs> I never bothered to get it. It's only added in this version, so who cares? Cross counter. That's not a cross counter. I don't know what a cross counter is to be quite honest. I just like pi uh, parroting fighting game shit that I don't quite understand. I continually have to remind myself that DP stands for Dragon Punch, and what a Dragon Punch actually fucking is. I am that much of a fraud. I'm walking to, into a wall. I can't even finish that sentence properly. Outstanding, man. Outstanding. <gasps> Helmosaurus! What ever could I do? 
You know what? They haven't noticed me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think his mate saw me. Wait, no. We can say, I think his mate saw me. Yes, yes he did. Those videos are still the best. The Meet the Team videos are still fucking legendary. That's a good thing. Like, I, I think a lot of people do understand it. A lot of people that care about games properly do understand the importance of art style. But I feel like a lot of people take it for granted. In that those videos, those Meet the Team videos for TF2 still hold up. They are still really nice. The Pixar-esque... Um, style they chose is great. They look really fucking good. Same way Wind Waker, the more you up it, looks even fucking better. I mean, I know it's a little hard to believe for some people, but OG Wind Waker still looks fucking amazing. When you consider the time period it was made in, and like, you you obviously see some jack- Oh, I was gonna say jaggies, but instead we got this shit. What the hell? Oh, Christ. Stop. Please. Yamaru. That's... Oh. Oh, why does it do that? I don't... I don't understand. I can't use this. I don't understand. I don't need to do that right now. Then the cursed music that is the training room starts bleeding. Wait, I don't need that at all, do I? I only need one of those. I missed. Wow, I'm clever. See, Shadow's still clipping. That's weird. Fuck you. Where are you, my child? I guess that's why they give you two Helmosaurs, in case you uh, drop one down. Well, I'm doing this amazingly. Amazing. Seif is still a bitch. 40 minutes later or so, and I haven't finished the dungeon, and yep, Seif is still a bitch. Don't reset the clock, you know, no need to reset the clock, it's still going. Reset the clock when Seif is no longer a bitch. I mean, I guess, in, like, there's a mod where he's not a bitch anymore, because someone, like, buffed the shit out of him, but... He's still a bitch. Except the Seif! Oh, what's wrong, see, man? Because you're gonna die one day? Because you ain't got no scales? I gotta say it, I'm sorry. Bitch ain't got no legs. Ain't even got legs. And there, I'm done. I've got it out of my system. I will try not to reference Dark Souls in summary. You know, another time in this video. I'll try to stop. I'm trying to break the habit, as Linkin Park said. See, I'm making references right now. Um... I'll, I'll attempt to break the habit. I don't need that. And we'll see how we go from there. Um, I'm probably going to reference it in another video. Don't worry about that. That'll happen. Smash. Oh, I'm stuck on a wall. Amazing. Yeah, I don't didn't want to do that, though. I want to do that. So I can do this. Ooh, rupee I don't need. Can you pick it up for me? No, you are not. Wait, yes, yeah. Oh, Twilight Princess was the tech demo for Astral Chain. And Nintendo had it in their, um, in their little stockpile, their Disney Vault. Just, um, a little nicer than the fucking Disney Vault. Um, and then they're like, yeah, oh, should we do something with it? Yeah, give it a Platinum. Hey, thank you. Yeah, give it a Platinum, I guess. I mean, Bayonet is alright. Reggie seems to like it. That, that was the fu you know what? No, it's applicable to two Reggies. You either know both or you know one for sh for certain. If there is any crossover, somehow, I, you know, maybe in the future when someone finds his archaic LP, but it's not actually archaic, it's quite modern when you think about it, um, they'll go, oh, I get that reference. Are you the one with Gomez in it? You're not the one with Gomez in it, great. Um, there was that story, oh uh, yeah, I should continue, there was that story about how Reggie looked at, um, 
what was it, at Bayo 2, and Platinum were being, apparently Platinum were like, oh, we should probably, uh, probably make it a little more modest. We should probably, uh, ease up on the sex and all that, and how provocative it is, and apparently Reggie went like, nah. What are you doing? No, don't. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> Allegedly, that's what happened. What a fucking legend Reggie is. And it's not the Reggie that likes feet. Or maybe the... I don't know. Uh, making references to people I don't know, and I'm acting like I know them. Yep, yep, that's, uh, that's what YouTube does. Thanks. Drop you hit. Let's go. We are almost out of this damn place. Almost out of here. You know, Left 4 Dead's the kind of game I'd think like, yeah, that'd be fun to play for like a one-off. But then I realize, due to my recording setup, I would want to play the Xbox 360 version. And that that is not a good idea. <laughs> And that I should just concede, and you know what, no, this is redundant, I don't need to do that. So I'd be playing the 360 version, and uh, I don't know how long I'd play that for. But, um, you'd also find it incredibly boring, because I am a very safe, boring player in that game. Especially given I rarely play online, majority of the time, oh, you know what, let's do the thing. Majority of the time, I am crawling at a snail pace, just cause. And I, I'm that kind of guy because of the bots. I stand there and I just go like, ooh, three Molotovs. And I pit them all. And pick up the one I had or whatever. And yeah. So this is the thing I was talking about. I can now be hit with impunity. Wow, that counter went down. Holy shit. Hey, joke's on you. I have to collect rupees again. Ha <laughs> ha. So there's legitimately no reason for killing him at the start. There is never. All right, now this should be the Beamos with the Gomez. Come on, I think I was forgetting about the the. Uh... Yep, I was forgetting about the pot. I was misremembering about there being a pot with Gomez. I don't think there is. I don't know why I thought that was the case. Weird. Hey, that's great. Fuck you. Break the fence. Break the walls. I don't know if there's a wrestler called Chris Jericho and he broke the walls allegedly. I don't know what else happened. I don't know anything about the guy. I just know him in passing. As a reference. Come on. Yes, my child. Well done. I will defeat this bitch-ass ghost with a pop. No, I will not. Let's dance. In the words of Bane, never. Well, let's dance, boys. I'm so happy so much awesome Bayo music got into Smash Bros. I'm, I'm sad not a lot of Metal Gear music's in. I'd say fuck Konami, but honestly, eh. There's quite, there's a decent amount, and it, that's kind of, this is one of the times where it's like, no, no, don't. No, don't say fuck Konami. Say fuck, fuck Konami for Smash 4 not having Snake. There's plenty of music, and I just wish there was more awesome Metal Gear music. And it's not quite the Final Fantasy, with Cloud having two songs. Um, which is, wow. Good work, Square. If anyone would say fuck Konami, too bad, we gotta say fuck Square Enix. It's only fair in this case. I'm sure Jim Sterling would agree. I'm stopping because I don't have anything to say right now. Give me a second. Um, the camera's not freaking out, so I can't talk about that shit. Um, uh, almost done with the dungeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, dungeon's almost done. Yeah, we can stop. We're, we're close, we're close. We're, um, I don't really need to go on about anymore. So you can smash that if you didn't get the chest the proper way. Nice. 
It's only a dumb little animation, nothing to get worked up over, but still. I like how dumb it is. Beautiful. It's beautiful, really. Hey, would you look about symmetry? Now, I was joking about Wind Waker, but isn't this the exact same thing? I know you control a statue for a bit, but it is the same thing. You have to get it to uh, make this little thing symmetrical, right? That's what happens in Wind Waker, yeah? Because I feel like that's what happens in Wind Waker. Oh, it's not even symmetrical. Because that one on the left is not on a pedestal. So inherently, this one is higher. So, the symmetry is not perfect. I actually forgot I had Uku. I, I haven't even thought about it, to be quite honest. I've only used it the once. Oh, this is a cool room. I like this. A little Sen's Fortress gauntlet. Temple of Time's Funhouse. We do need two of those little guys, so... Bam. When it comes around. Gotcha. It's also very generous, so it's, it's not like I'm an amazing shot or anything. Because the game's just being very nice. I just think it's neat. Okay. So you want to know an awesome act of betrayal you have to perform here? It's, it's like Super Mario World where you abandon Yoshi. Actually, you can just walk forward, can't you? Yeah. I was going to say, um, typically you walk forward, so he falls down the pit. Ah, oh, I'm gendering it. That means I'm attacked. You know, I'm just calling it an it. I mean... I don't know where I'm going with this, so I'm going to stop, but... I like those little guys. They're, they're literally just like metal things. Maybe stone, I don't know. Probably metal, I imagine. And like, you do nothing with them, but I still like them. And again, I have... I don't know why. I'm not making an in-the-end reference for once. It would be too easy, and I've hit my Lincoln Park quota, so... Okay, what email has my fucking phone got now? I don't want to be part of the uni alumni. Get out of here. I don't care. Stop sending me emails about that. It's been three and a half years. I don't want to... I don't care. You know what I care about, though? Big ass mama spiders. Let's get it. Twilight Arachnid. Armagoma. Armagoma. I wonder what we can do. So you might notice, Arma Gomer has her uh, eye closed. Um, the symbolism here is, I don't know, make some bullshit up. But what you do is pretty fucking awesome. Oh Christ, we're not close enough. Get him! Found that spider. Oh shit, could we go for another one? Nope, doesn't matter. Now, in some of in some of the old pre-release footage, like the stuff I was talking about a while back, is this when she lets out the babies? Yep. Um, there was footage, um, along with a lot of cut stuff. I inevitably cut stuff. No, nope, I want to lock onto the, the spiders. I want to lock onto the spiders. Um, there was a scene where Armagoma was chasing you through a forest. Presumably, well, the forest temple. And that ends our no-hit run. Also, yeah, she fires lasers. Ow. Look at Dark Eater Meteor over here. I wonder if you're ballsy enough if you can shoot a ball. Yeah, you should be able to, actually. Um. But yeah, there was going to be a cool part where you, uh, chase her. Well, you get chased, rather. Through a forest. Oh, come on. Where are those fangs at? Yeah. Invincible. Damn, I never noticed how dumb that looks. Now, we can't nail her with this, unfortunately. She won't open her eye. To birth her youngins. Yeah. You know what? Screw this.
Can we walk up to Amagoma with um with a huge ass railgun and shove it down a gaping maw until the next time take the fucking hint? It's not quite it's not quite a seeing stars, but it's pretty good. I was happy with the ending. I mean that's kind of a hard thing to do where fuck. That's kind of a hard position to be put in where it's like do you quote the same thing or do you try to have your own identity and go with a new line? It's weird though, like I was just looking through some some stuff. I was listening to some of the uh, Nemesis music last night. And you get people going on about, oh the game was shit. Nah, RE3 wasn't shit. It was a little disappointing I guess, but it wasn't shit. I quite, it's that kind of situation where even if I thought it was absolute garbage, there were a lot of awesome little changes they made that I'd love to see in a sequel type of thing. Like in what presumably might be 8 or Resident Evil 4 Remake. Also, <gasps> Masaka. Now, there's one way, well there's two ways to do this. One is the boring way, the other is the way everyone ever tried. I will probably die from this. That would be awesome if I did. Get back here, you fucks. Let's spin out the herd. Come on, come back. Let me do the thing. Let me do the thing absolutely no one cares about. I like this music too, so it's a nice way to protract it. Wow. Okay, fuck this. Yeah? What you got? What you got? Come on, come on. Yeah, okay, it doesn't like the spinner. Alright, well, fuck you. I'm gonna pick off every single one of your babies. All for revenge. For revenge, I don't need. Miller, Miller would be very proud. I didn't get all of them, but who cares. Yeah, squash and stretch. Beautiful. Did I needlessly draw out that last part? I mean, yes, by accident. It's not like I'm getting revenue from this shit. If there is an ad, if if it isn't out on this video, that means Nintendo decided to remonetize shit, or I use copyrighted music. I don't think I would have done the for the, the latter, and I don't think Nintendo would be doing the former again, because that'd be suicide. Oh, sorry, should be paying attention. Yep, one more piece. But where to go next? Are you excited for a long ass fetch quest? I know I am. Feeble cursed one, are you strong enough to go around and get all the statues and places you've already been? Heh <laughs> heh. Feeble cursed one, take these arrows and stop being so weak. That is a shit strayed, but I don't care. Straight is so fucking cool. What a hero. Even though there was a chance he was a bad dude. Yep, that isn't even the same hour. That is... Yeah, I'll look at it later and work out how... You know what, fuck it. How fast is this? It's 1.45. Do the math, kids. Yeah, much for muchness. It's 44 minutes. Should be... Oh, no, we're good. Yes, it should be 44. Alright, well, we're done. See you later, fuckers. Time to end the episode, I guess. Well, thanks for tagging along, gang. It's been a great time down here at the Temple of Time. Um, oh, well, we're not quite done yet. Remember, don't do drugs. I'm um, sorry, wait, no, I'm fucking this up. I gotta steal that bit Zontan did that one time. Don't do school and stay in drugs. Yeah, that's the one. Was that for the brawl? I don't remember. I think that was one of the promos for the, um, for Russell Mania. <gasps> Bitch ass ghost. Approaching a very high good speed. Is that an old meme by now? Yep, it, yep, yeah, it is an old meme. I think it was old back, uh, back when Dark Souls 3 came out. Wait, no, Dark Souls... 
I don't know when. I don't know. I don't remember when that was. It's a pretty timeless kind of format, though. Just have something move a lot faster for comedic effect. Anyway, sorry. Guess we're done here. Um, like I said, stay in drugs. Don't do school. Um, have you guys heard about Persona? It's like crack. Oh. I obviously remembered this, don't worry. I mean, I think it's pretty blatant from the setup. So, here's the fetch quest. Clock, clock, clock. Those are some strong legs. Hmm. A useless rod. Yep, just let it sit. Can't even whack people with it. Let's have a look. It's red so it goes faster. Well, it's kind of red. It's not useful for anything though. It's way more red on the item menu. Alright, well that's that. Temple time done. Um, oh, Snail Quinn's there. What's up dude? I got your, uh, your ancestor I guess. I mean, I guess that's what they are. Oh yeah, there's the spinner track. That's the one thing I'll do. Sorry, but this is kind of just protracting things, but... Yeah. And there's that one spinner spot. So I might go do that, just to... I mean, it's only an hour and a half. It's not even an hour and a half this episode, so it's not really a true Baron Von Lag LP episode, is it? I mean... All those parts of a Bloodborne LP, I should just smash together for long, you know, the longer parts, really. Like, what's the point of having consideration for the dear viewer? I want to protract this. Maybe there's a beehive here, too. Because there is a fishing hole somewhere. I don't know. I want to end it so badly. I don't even know why you look down. I want to end it on that, but we're getting the last thing. Fuck this. That was so limp and pathetic. Alright, let's get this sacred treasure. It's the X stamp. Port of Xenoblade X confirmed for Switch. No. And that sucks. Hey, you know what? Let's walk forward, because I know what's going to happen. Yep. That saves me if I uh, want to do some stuff in between. If I'm going to do any cleanup, it'll be either after City in the Sky, or it'll be after the mysterious 8th dungeon that is well known at this point. Because this game's old. Yeah, I've only caught three fish. God damn it, I'm a, I'm, yeah, shit. Yeah. Well, guess we gotta go to uh, Red and Williams' um, little sanctuary. There's no grass though, so that sucks. Well, there's horse grass there. Yeah, fuck it. Let's just let's just wolf up and uh, head out. Fuck this. That's a nice hill though. That's a nice Windows XP hill. Serpentine. Oh, there's a dig cave up there, but I did it. It's not really that interesting. Texture on the pyramid is, though. Okay, let's hope this, uh, let's hope this isn't too long. Because this can be really fun sometimes. Oh, what you got? Surprise, motherfucker. If this was a platinum game, that would be a combo. Actually, yeah, that could be, like, you know what? Thinking about it, I think that the only mechanic they didn't bring back that they've used um okay i'll try to articulate the sentence a little better i'll try to phrase it better so astral chain is basically a melting pot of everything astral um fucking platinum ever did in my opinion it's got a lot of stuff they've experimented with it's got like the pseudo stealth stuff of um not very good though admittedly <laughs> um of metal gear rising uh it's got well you know, their trademark slow time slow shit. 
it's got all this really cool stuff I've experimented with over the years. So much so, I'm kind of skim skimming over a lot of it. One second. Take the damage. Worth it. Um, but yeah, they've got all these cool... It's a cool little melting pot of all the tech they tried. There's a cave down there, I might do that too. Um, but yeah, no, it's just like a nice little culmination of everything they did. And to get to the point... Um, oh, I should have jumped properly. How the fuck did I miss you? Oh, because I went too fast. Um, but one thing I don't think they included was the transformation stuff from Transformers Prime. Uh, Prime. Transformers Devastation. Which is weird, because that was really cool. That's why, like, I, again, I haven't played much of Bayo 1 or 2. But, um, that's why Devastation was actually my favourite for quite some time. Until Astral Chain came along, because I thought it was really sick, doing all that cool stuff. The transformation attacks were really cool, and if, you know, if Platinum were making this game, guess what? You transform out of Wolf Link into a hit, as, you know, into normal Link. Oh, come on. I want to jump off the edge just to, just to punctuate this, but you can't say it wasn't worth it. You can't say it, but I can feel it. <laughs> 